Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you believe you have corrupt system files on your Windows computer. So whether it's acting slow or you see a lot of blue screen errors and it just doesn't seem to be working properly. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys a couple of different commands you can run through the command line window to hopefully get your computer back up and running as it should. And we're going to go ahead and jump right into it. So we're going to start by opening up the start menu. Just off click on the start button one time, type in CMD into the start menu. Best match should come back with CMD or command prompt. You want to right click on it and then select run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, you want to left click on yes. Now the first command I will have in the description of the video as, as well as on the screen. So first one we're going to type in is CHK, DSK space forward slash f then another space forward slash r so again chk dsk and then a space followed by a forward slash f followed by another space and then forward slash r all lowercase hit enter on your keyboard it says check this cannot run because the volume isn't used by another process would you like to schedule this volume to be checked the next time your system restarts tap the y key on your keyboard then hit enter it says the volume will be checked the next time your system restarts. So I'd suggest closing out of here. And now we're going to go ahead and restart our computer. So close out of any open programs and applications. And then we're going to go ahead and restart our device. So at this part, make sure you do not press any key. You want to enable the disk checking, so just don't tap anything on your keyboard.
Okay, so once your computer is booted back up, you want to go open up the Start menu again. Type in CMD. Best match to come back with command prompt. You want to right click on that and then left click on run as administrator. If you receive a user account control prompt, left click on yes. Now into this LVA command line window, you want to type in SFC space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word attached to that forward slash. So again, SFC and a space forward slash scan now. Hit enter on your keyboard. This will take a couple minutes to run, so please be patient.
Okay, so once it's finished here, you should go ahead and restart your computer, but it did see Windows Resource Protection found corrupt files and successfully repaired them. So, pretty straightforward process here, guys. You can see the location on your computer where the log files are stored if you want to see anything about exact files that were repaired. So, pretty straightforward process here, guys. Do go to be able to help you out, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.